English made easy. Unlocking reduced relative clauses with adjectives. Hello learners, welcome back to our English Made Easy series. Today, we're going to explore an interesting and useful part of English grammar. Reduced relative clauses with adjectives. By mastering this topic, you'll be able to write and speak English in a more natural and fluent way. So, let's get started. Before we dive into reduced relative clauses with adjectives, let's quickly recap what a relative clause is. Relative clauses are types of dependent clauses that give essential or non-essential information about a noun or noun phrase. They start with relative pronouns like who, which, that, etc. For example, the book that you gave me is fascinating. Here, that you gave me is the relative clause describing the book. Now, what exactly are reduced relative clauses? Well, they're simply a way of shortening a relative clause. They make our speech and writing more concise, while keeping the same meaning. When we remove the relative pronoun and the be verb, we're left with a reduced relative clause. For instance, the sentence, the book that is on the table is mine, can be reduced to, the book on the table is mine. The true magic happens when we start reducing relative clauses with adjectives. We can reduce a relative clause to an adjective phrase, and the result is a much simpler, cleaner sentence. Let's take an example. We have a sentence, the man who is happy is my friend. We can reduce the relative clause, who is happy, to the adjective, happy, and we end up with, the happy man is my friend. Now that we understand the theory, let's look at some examples. 1. The flowers that are yellow are daffodils. Becomes, the yellow flowers are daffodils. 2. The dog that is playful is chasing its tail. Becomes, the playful dog is chasing its tail. 3. The woman who is excited is my sister. Becomes, the excited woman is my sister. See how the sentence structure is simplified while the meaning remains the same? That's it for today's lesson on reduced relative clauses with adjectives. Remember, learning is all about practice. So, try to incorporate these into your daily English usage. I'm sure you'll notice a significant improvement in your fluency. Keep practicing, and I'll see you in our next lesson. Happy learning! Remember, the key is to reduce the relative clause to an adjective phrase. By doing this, we simplify our sentences while maintaining the same meaning. It's an excellent tool for making your English sound more fluent and natural. So keep practicing.